Hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog. Today is Saturday. We are doing a weekend vlog this time and y'all know the first order of business on Saturdays is stopping by Lambert's Cafe and then we're going to the Black Foodie Festival. Lambert's was a contestant. Hope you did stop by if you do live in Charlotte. So we're heading there and then the Black Foodie Festival and y'all know I never have like a solid plan for the day. So I'll be taking you guys throughout the day. So y'all just come along with me. Let's see what all we get into. Y'all, we made it. I hate uptown because of the parking, but the parking was only $10 for 10 hours. So we're good. I'm here with my sister. And now we're about to go join the line to get in. I'm so excited about the vegan food that's here. I might mute some of this though because there's music playing and y'all know about monetization. Enjoy uptown. Hey you guys, we are back after the Black Foot event. We were drained, like literally freaking drained. So we ended up eating and taking a nap. That food was not worth $50. But I did eat it because, I mean, I got it. But it was not worth $50. It was oyster mushrooms, the veggie short ribs, and what else? Some vegan shrimp. It was all right. I'm not really into too many vegan substitutes. Y'all might see me try it because I'm just a foodie and I like to try everything. But if you want to transition to like not eating meat, it is not wise to have so many substitute things. And on the same breath, I'm about to go ahead and try these vegan eggs. Because it's interesting. It's just an interesting concept. And I got a little fried chicken ice cream. We tried these already. You guys seen it, but we're going to have it again. And I'm going to tell you guys my first impression on these vegan eggs. Time to try the Wonder Eggs from Whole Foods. So you unbox it and you have the eggs. And then they give you a pack of salt and pepper. I like my devil eggs usually with uh, seasoning salt. And this was only $6. Yeah, $6 for six eggs. It was on sale. And they said to scoop, well I'll be seeing people scoop it out with a spoon, but it looks so nasty. Let's see. Salt and pepper. Here you get your dog. It feels like an egg. Slippery. Like a boiled egg. It don't smell. It smells like dog food. It barely got a smell. Tastes like an egg. It do? Okie dokie, time to put the salt and pepper on here. Just a oh, black salt. Okay. 
And this was founded by a woman. This all look different. Hey guys, what's the leak? Oh, stink breaking and smelling. <laughs> it's stink. <laughs> what's hot? <laughs> it's it's hot like a yolk. This is good. So y'all, my camera died. Oh my hair. So y'all, my camera died. So we are back from this angle, and now we're gonna try. I did put the salt on it. I hope it saved that part. And my sister did try to eat her eggs. She said it stink. It's not like eggs. It's not like it's, Yeah. Let's see. The white tastes like eggs. They like jello. It's like the eggs. Mm -mm. It tastes like jello. Like I want to be an egg so well. Huh? It tastes like double eggs. Mm hmm. The middle's good. It just don't sit right with me. I like it. Yes. I don't know. She mashed up chickpeas. You know what Mm hmm. I just want to know how to smell like this. Water, almonds, cashews, coconut milk. Smell like spark spray. <laughs> Agar. That, or is it, I don't know. Agar. That's what made the white. It's jelly. -y. And I'm guessing the yeast went in to make the. Oh, good. I like it. If you're a vegan, you must not have eggs. This is good. I give it a um about it a, a eight. I don't give it a ten because the texture is weird. So I give it an eight. I like it. I give it a six. Why? Six. They don't just don't sit right. It tastes like chickpeas. And then um, No it don't. It stink. It the smell just throwing me off. I think it's worse than a real egg. <laughs> The outside don't smell like nothing, but the inside. <laughs> it's by a lady. She found it to burn because she felt bad for chickens in 2019. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Interesting. So yeah, y'all, check it out. Obviously, it's not sponsored because I just seen it on TikTok. So yeah, check it out and let me know what you think. Now we're gonna eat this. My sister broke it. I think I did a video showing y'all the chicken before. The little. The little chicken ice cream. Yeah, I'm not doing the DIY whole home thing. But, you know, frosted flakes on the outside, vanilla ice cream, and the Twix on the inside. Bam. Okay, so let's see. It might taste like chicken. I haven't had it in a while, so y'all can tell me chicken tastes like anything. <laughs> you know, if it's probably sitting there like, eat. <laughs> That's definitely, that's, oh shoot, that's the skin. <laughs> Sorry y'all, that's the chip, that's the skin. Mm. Easy, easy. I'm eating chicken. Oh my gosh, it's so good. Fried chicken. 13 years of not eating meat. Finally decided to mm -hmm. eat chicken today. Love a lot. Amina mean, don't taste that. <laughs> okay, so y'all, nothing special. Um, shoot, stop. Nothing special. It's just vanilla ice cream with um, the baby don't like it. Cornflakes on the outside. My niece did not approve. But it's cornflakes with vanilla ice cream and then on the inside it's like a chocolate stick for the bone. I haven't gotten to the bone yet, so. Oh, that's too hard. Mm -mm. Hey y'all, it is Sunday morning and I am fully dressed for church. I wanted to start doing like a church get ready with me. Would y'all be interested in that? Like if y'all be interested in that, then I'll definitely take time to do it. But yeah, I'm ready for church. Um, just added some curls to my hair. Today is a regular Sunday, not sure if I'll vlog in church. It's just always so awkward for me. But yeah, on Sundays, I go to church every single Sunday. And y'all, excuse this quality. I'm using the face front of my iPhone. I don't feel like grabbing my camera, so yeah. But anyways, I'm dressed, about to head to church, and I'm, I might take y'all with me. Not sure yet. So yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> okay, so the first order of business when I get to church is going to Lambert's. And this video is special because this is Eli's first time coming to church. He's interacting with Judah. 
make sure you check out his channel with his parents Eve and Tyler they have a really good channel it'll be linked in my description box and boom right here is me trying to learn how to play the tambourine yes y'all I'm a Pentecostal girl who does not have any rhythm so <laughs> there that goes and then here's Natasha in the back she can't get up right now so yeah and I'm giving y'all a voiceover because everyone likes my church content so yeah this is the best I can do and this is us welcoming our new visitors. We have our own song. And there's Akita and Chloe talking in service, per usual. <laughs> and Prophet Karn came out here. The service was getting good right here. The service is always good, but of course, everybody felt it here. And now we're just worshiping some more. We do a lot of singing at our church because Prophet Karn is also an artist his music is streamed on every single platform and we also love to worship God in our church so we do a lot of singing so yeah enjoy our choir here and I'm probably in the back clapping or dancing with no rhythm but that's neither here nor there and I do take notes on my iPad so that's why it's out and now we have a solo from Prophet Khan we're about to get into the word so we do worship before getting into the word. This is actually one of my favorite songs. And right here, I was just into the service. I posted this clip and got so many comments, but I was eating the mentos, y'all. Good morning, you guys. Today is Monday morning, and I'll be taking y'all to guess where again, church. Because today is um, because today is the first day of what's brewing is basically Prophet Karn's morning show, TV show that goes on in the morning. So if you're in Charlotte and you do wanna be a part of the live audience, you can always do so by visiting the What's Brewing page. So that's what I'm doing today. And I'll try to take you guys through as much as it as I can, but it is a production, so it's kinda of awkward trying to get my footage and, you know, helping with production. So we'll see, but good morning, you guys. Hey, you guys. So it is about six to seven hours later. The last time you guys see me, I was at church at the What's Brewing Live TV show. If you live in Charlotte, North Carolina, and you would like to visit or be a part of our live show, the invite goes out or like the registration link goes out on Fridays, but I'll definitely put it in my description box if you want to sign up and just be a part of the live audience. Like it's different topics every single week. It's a pretty good time. I tried to show y'all as much as I can in church and like at the What's Brewing broadcast, but it's always so awkward vlogging in church and like just taking out my camera and just boom in front of people's faces in church. It's just awkward. But anyways, I tried to get y'all as much as I could. It was great. I enjoyed it. And now I'm just here. My head hurts so bad, you guys. My camera just got dark out of nowhere. But anyways, my head hurts so bad, you guys. I was gonna start my fitness journey again, but the way the headache is looking is a no for me. I'm currently 158 pounds. I want mine being 160 and like parking it there. I don't wanna go over 160, but yeah. Fitness journey coming soon. Excuse my crusty lips, you guys. Fitness journey coming soon, hopefully. <laughs> and yeah, what's new? Oh yeah, and convocation is also coming up. So if you want to be a part of that with my church, I think it's, yeah, it's July 11th to the 16th. If you want to be a part of that, that's in my description box. And, and what I'm going to do for the rest of the night is, is talk to the stylist that I'm working with for a convocation because 
I don't want to look for that stuff. Like one, I'm not into Kojic fashion. Two, I don't know where all the stuff is at. So, well, let me say this. I'm not into Kojic fashion for me, but I love looking at it on other people. Like, I love looking at Kojic fashion for other people. So yeah, I'm working with the designer. Wait for him to text. Actually, I think he did text me back. No, it was my cousin, but I went for him to text me back. He created like style boards and stuff. So yeah, in the next vlog, I'll be going to Jacksonville again. We have a women's conference. So I'll be in Jacksonville from Wednesday to Sunday. I'll start the vlog there. And when I get back, I'll be going to church Sunday service. Then I will be going to What's Brewing Live. Then we have Bible study, but it's online. So I guess that's kind of like a break, even though I love church, you guys, but yeah. And then we have convocation coming up, so that's a week of church. But it's okay, praise the Lord. If you wanna be a part of any of the events at my church, just, you know, check out my description box. Yeah, and make sure you check out Lambert's Cafe as well. But anyways, you guys, I'm just rambling. I have a headache. I'm going to edit this vlog so it can be up at a decent time. And I will see you guys in the next vlog. Thank you so much for sticking with me. I'll see you guys later.